G'day Westy here. Okay, we're working on a project car. It's a 1994 uh, VW Golf and we're doing quite a few bits and pieces on it. And um, so what I'm going to do is show you a little trick how that we've got the gearbox and the, and the um, clutch and everything out. So I'm going to show you a trick how to get out the um, crankshaft rear crankshaft seal without creating too much drama. So what you're going to need is you're going to need a drill and a drill bit, about 2 mil. You're going to need um, a screwdriver, oh you won't need that actually. A pair of side cutters and you will need a, um, oh hang on I need to get my other part. You'll need an impact driver and a little self tapping screw. Right so you've got a couple, a number, number 2 square drive self tapping screws. Number 2 driver. And an impact driver. So first things first is I'm going to climb under here and drill two holes in the crankshaft seal. Um, so I'm just going to do that now quickly. Bear with me. Just come up through the top here, Zach. Okay, so I'm just going to drill, if you can see this come around the other, facing down on this angle here from the top. Okay, so if you see the seal here, it's really, really wet, so it's um, leaking. So what I'm going to do, is I'm going to drill a hole in each side, not through the casing or anything like that, just through the actual seal itself. So I'll just drill a little, it's only a 2mm or 2.5mm hole. Get the other one on the opposite side. You'll understand why in a second. I'll show you. Try and get it in the centre of where the, um, the casing is, and don't push too hard. When it starts biting in, that's when it's just about to go through. And try and keep it square so we'll get away the excess filings here. And I'm just going to screw these little self tappers. Just in like that, not too far. I've only got little shorties. Okay, so now that's in, and I'll get my side cutters, which are up the top there. I think the my red-handed side cutters. Ta. And then I'm just gonna each side. I'm just gonna grab my side cutters. Go to the outside of the casing and I'm just going to pull on it just like that. And that will pull the seal out very, very easily without having to destroy anything. Just like that. 